Yo, what's up guys? Uh, this is Mana, and welcome back to again another Cloud Rise Academy video. Before we get into this video, I did say I was going to do interface, but I, I switched it up. Interface video will be coming next video, alright? promise you guys. A lot of people have been asking me, hey, have you played solo with a controller? Have you played, you know, is this game going to be played with a controller? And the short answer is yes. Have I played with a controller? Yes, I actually tried it out. And there's a lot of other MMORPGs that utilize controllers, let's say uh, Final Fantasy XIV, Elder Scrolls Online, Neverwinter, DC Universe Online, there's just some of the games that utilize uh, a controller and it makes for the gameplay for just chill gameplay, you know, when you want to chill, lay back on your seat and just, you know, if you're gathering or just doing random quests, I'm going to show you guys how to do that real quick. So we're going to go ahead and bring this up. But as you can see, I got all of my key bindings here, but, you know, for using a mouse and keyboard. But if I turn on my Xbox controller and I move my Xbox controller, it changes. You got X, Y, right trigger X, right trigger Y. And it just changes all of these things on here, which, you know, you can start attacking with your Xbox controller. It's really freaking cool that they do this, man. It's uh, it's really nice. I really do like that they give you the ability to do that. But before you're starting to make your keybinds, you have to find out which bars you're going to be using for your skills. And to do that, you're going to press Escape, go to your interface settings. So as you can see, Quick Bar 6 and Quick Bar 2 is what I use. All right, so we got to remember Quick Bar 6 and Quick Bar 2. So once you're done here, you're going to go ahead and go to your shortcut settings. You're going to go down to um, the gamepad, which is the last tab you open here. It tells you what to do here, you know, all the other key bindings here. You want to go to your quick bar and you know, look for what was ours? Quick bar six and quick bar two, I think. So you look for the quick bar where it starts. So let's go look for quick bar six. So quick bar six, bam, starts here. So now that you know which quick bars you're going to be using, you're going to go ahead and use keybinds that you're used to. Keybinds that are, you know, for you. Don't You don't have to copy my key bindings because this is for me. This is how I play. I'm pretty sure you guys have different key bindings you guys would use. But you could use a plethora of things. Like if I move my character again, you could use like um, right trigger and then left on the D-pad. Right trigger down the D-pad. There's like a lot of button combinations you can use within the game that you could enjoy solo with a controller basically and it's really freaking cool um so they have other stuff you got your character stuff like they show you how to you know jump up and down you have your select targets here and it gives you like a full shows you the controller here basically and it tells you you know to sw swap targets you know lock onto um to target your friendly targets if you're healing and stuff like that and it's pretty good i would say the controller support on this game is great i did some dungeons i did um some open world content on it there and I think that it's freaking great. And for anyone, I have not tested this on a PS5 controller or PS4 controller, but I'm pretty sure if you plug in any controller and you move around, it should work. Don't like, don't quote me on that though. I said it should. So take it with a grain of salt. But yeah, the Xbox controllers uh, work flawlessly uh, within Solo, which is great. So I'm gonna show you a little bit of combat so we can just go ahead and get into it, just straight into it. All right, so let's go ahead. Let us let me just zoom out real quick. I don't like it being all up on my grill like that, you know what I mean? All right, so we got Chanchi right here. We're gonna go ahead and do this. You see, you see? I am now doing all my damage stuff right now too. And this Chanchu is dead. And you dodge with B, with the B button also. So, I mean, it's freaking, it, it's, it's pretty cool, guys. Let's go ahead and just get some more stuff going on here too. Go in right here. Let's go ahead. We're gonna use our right bumper X now and go ahead and start. Our right trigger and X is ready to go too. Well, he's already dead. I do so much damage already. This guy is like almost 70 item level right now. So he is doing some nice hella amounts of damage. <laughs> it just kills the challenge shoes real quick. Um, but there should be some over here. just want to just keep on showing you basically how it is and how it looks like, you know? There goes some over here. Let's go ahead and do this. I'm using my power up here too, and he's already dead. So as you can see, you can play this game perfectly with a freaking controller, and it's just, it's great. Um, if you guys want to play with a controller just for the leisurement of, you know, crafting and just doing your dailies, you don't have to be, you can just slouch back on your chair and just play then you can do it. Solo allows you to do that, which is really cool and makes me love this game more and more because there's just so much options for you to play the game how you want to play, you know, with controller or mouse, which is pretty cool. So guys, if this video has helped you, you know, um, just leave a like, 
sub to the channel and let me know what you want me to do next obviously we know the interface video is coming next and the big reason why i wanted to make this video is because people were confused on how to do the controller setup and the controller stuff so hopefully you know me teaching you guys here in this really quick tutorial helps you guys out and to be honest i want i want to kill one more thing because this this is really fun playing on a controller to be honest like it really it really feels like a a bit different with me when i play mmos with a controller sometimes it's like yo and this game just fits so well playing fiction controller man i just love it so now we're gonna go ahead and use our right trigger and the uh, left in the d-pad right there we just did that right now oh my god all right guys as always thank you guys for watching this video and we will see you guys next time take care